Morning, your motherfucking sunshines. Good morning, fuckers. Hell yeah. Well, last night was an interesting evening. My fucking tent collapsed on me twice. Still not perfect, but goddamn. I knew it was gonna happen. This this where I set it up isn't the greatest spot. I mean, all this location's all loose sand and shit. And when you're setting up non-freestanding tents in the sand and shit, you're supposed to, you know, as a safety precaution, put rocks on your lines and shit. Well, there's no goddamn rocks on there. There's only fucking cactus and shit. And I'm about to start digging that shit out of the ground. Fuck that noise. But yeah, my stakes pulled out twice last night. The winds came in, and believe it or not, I woke up with some sprinkling this morning. What the fuck in the desert and it's still cloudy as shit and cold and fuck. Ugh. Already bitching. <laughs> Took all the 10 minutes, goddamn. Anywho, I did get some sleep last night. I mean, my pad laid it again too. It was a shitty night, whatever. We're live, man. We're all, we're all been kicking. All right, well, today the plan going into Paradise Valley Cafe, nine fucking miles. Should be an easy hike, I reckon. One would hope. Get me supposedly the best cheeseburger on the PCT. We'll see. I gotta charge some shit up. Now, I mentioned last night that. I was considering what I'm going to do about Idlewild. <sighs> so, supposedly, according to Gut Hooks, the easiest place to hitch into Idlewild is from the Paradise Valley Cafe. Highway 74 rides, runs right along there. It's a long fucking hitch, but it's supposedly easy to get a hitch in there. Now, today's Monday. I did, my room at the uh, lodge is, bu is booked for Wednesday. So, you know, either I go into town in the cafe today, try to change my reservation, which is probably bucked up, or, I was looking at Gugs last night in the map. There's like two outs I can take. If I start, once I start climbing up the San Jacinto's, two outs, side trails I can take down into Idlewild. That'll put me in there my normal schedule I had planned on on Wednesday. Um, now, you're going to start climbing, all right? And my micro spikes are in Idlewild. And, um, but I think the snow has melted at lower elevation around where I'm going to be taking those outs into Idlewild is about 8,300 feet, I reckon. I think the snow has melted down there by now. So I should be fine. It is off trail miles to get in there, but whatever. That's what my original plan was. So I'm going to stick with it, mine. Um, obviously, that could fucking change. I want to talk to the locals here in Idlewild and see if they know anything more about those side trails and how gnarly they are. But we're going to stick to the normal plan. I got enough food to last me till Wednesday, I reckon. And, uh, yeah, that's fucking it. I don't want to fucking freeze my ass off. Goddamn sun. I was cursing the sun for the last fucking 10, 11 days, where the fuck it is, and now I'm cursing the goddamn cold. What the hell? Anywho, we'll be back on trail shortly. It's going to be a great, great, great fucking day. Gorgeous. See the sun coming up over there. So cloudy as fuck, but goddamn. Anywho, got asked on Instagram the other day. People that follow me, I never know. I'm farther ahead than my videos, obviously, but I'm like, well, I mean, over a week in now, week and a half in, whatever the fuck it is, has your enthusiasm for hiking changed since you started? My enthusiasm for hiking will never fucking change. It's, I could do this shit every fucking day of my life. If the funds were there and I was able to do it and I didn't have Roscoe at home and shit and loved the ones to get back home too and shit. But yeah, my, I mean, the mountain views and everything, that's just gravy to me. It's just a, I, the, what I love most is just the activity of fucking hiking and everything that surrounds it. I mean, you're waking up in a new spot every fucking day. You're living free as can fucking be, you know, 
cooking out of a fucking titanium pot and you're fucking enjoying your coffee in your tent every morning it's just everything that goes along with it but the actual act of just hiking it's just therapy man it is therapy for me i just zone the fuck out and don't even think about shit you just one foot in front of the goddamn other it's the easiest goddamn task in the world but yet it's the most satisfying that i've found in my fucking life i could walk every day all day for the rest of my fucking life i love this shit man All right, fuckers, a nice, easy walk this morning. Still got the raincoat on, and I'm gonna sweat my ass off. <laughs> Whatever. That wind, once you get up in those ridge lines, can cut right through you, so. The, I've said it before, these rain jackets are not for rain, they're a fucking warmth layer, and that's what I use it for, so. Anywho, uh, yeah. Shocking, breaking news, the plans have changed. Yeah, that's why you don't make plans out on these long trails. Shit fucking changes on the daily, man, by the hour, anywho. I'm going into town today. Um, yeah, I just got a hold of Silver Pines Lodge where I had a room booked on Wednesday. And like I said, after looking at the map last night, the easiest way to hitch into town <coughs> in Idlewild is from this Paradise Valley Cafe I'm coming up on. Now, if I was to go farther, then I'm going, you're, you're going up in the San Jacinto, so you're climbing, and then you have to climb down like two miles, and then two miles back up just to get back to the PCT. I don't want to stress myself out on that shit. I'll just, it's a long hitch. It's like 15 miles, 20 miles maybe in Iowa, but it's a major fucking highway. I guess hikers do it all the time. So <sighs> that's a little bit of a load off. I can relax. I'm going to take my fucking zero day tomorrow. So I've got a nice private cabin for two nights with a fireplace at the Silver Pines Lodge starting tonight, man. <sighs> now let's go get to fucking town and get me the best cheeseburger in the fucking nation. Supposedly. I highly doubt it though. We'll see that on there, mine. Well, it's a good thing I'm going into town because I cannot fucking hike after that goddamn burger. Half a pound, bacon, mushroom, Swiss, avocado, and fucking, what else did I get on that bitch? Oh, jalapenos. Fucking unreal. I'm feeling fat and jolly. But I'll see how far, uh, how long it takes to get a fucking hitch. 14 miles in Idlewild. See what happens, man. music. All right, motherfuckers, we are here at Silver Pines Lodge. Uh, kind of justified me coming into town today because, yeah, it is fucking pissing rain in the desert right now. It's cold as fuck out, so hell yeah. Right decision getting into town from the uh, Paradise Valley Cafe. Fucking awesome. This is my digs, man. It's fucking, I got my own private little goddamn cottage. Hell yeah. Killer fucking bed. Uh, it's got a, even a, got my own fucking fridge in here, kitchenette and shit, sink. Ghetto ass TVs I won't use. I don't fucking bathroom. Look at this shit. My own shower. Fucking living guy like a goddamn king. Anywho, they teased me and put a fireplace in this bitch and no fucking firewood. I'm sure you have to pay extra for that shit. Whatever. The main lodge in there is fucking baller as shit. I will show you that shit tomorrow. Right now, I just want to fucking relax. I am doing laundry. They're doing the laundry for me, which is another fucking killer deal about staying here. I gotta shower the fuck up because I reek and I stink and I'm caked in fucking dirt. And we will check back in with you later when I got a fucking appetite, man. I'm still digesting that massive fucking burger. <laughs> All 
right, fucker, still rainy, pissy. I'm so goddamn glad I came into town today. But whatever, laundry's done. I'm just gonna relax on that, I think. I will show you around this, like, village. I don't know if it's really talents. It's like more like a village you'd see, like a ski resort or something like that. It's pretty fucking cool. But uh, I'm just gonna go out and get some ice cream, I think, to bring it back to my room. And uh, grab a coffee, because I'm fucking cold and rainy and shitty. So I want something to warm me up, goddammit. <laughs> Holy fuck, I come out here to sunny, sunny California, and what does it do? Fucking piss all over you. God damn. <laughs> oh, whatever, I'm glad I came into town to avoid hiking in this shit. I got me a two liter Diet Coke. I got me some Pringles. I got me some goddamn Haagen Dots because the gas station didn't have Ben and Jerry's. And I got me treat myself with a little long cut grizzly wintergreen, man. I'm gonna call that a day, man. I'm gonna get out of this fucking wet shit. In my private fucking cabin bed, relax and watch the Gilmore Girls. I will see you tomorrow for my zero day in Idlewild, California. We'll holler at you motherfuckers in the morning, man. Oh,